so that, that's, a, that's a really, really interesting uh, question. And, and that's because that's how it's really uh, marketed just now, uh, the skincare area. But no matter what age we are, uh, our skin requires the same things. Now, it might be that when we're older, uh, our, our skin is, is less supplied with oil, uh, oils, etc., and we want, might, might want to do that. But this is where EpiGN is different. EpiGN, it does not matter what age you are. Uh, uh, and uh, I have teenagers of, uh, using uh, EpiGN serum. I have people in their 80s using EpiGN serum. I have people using it on their arms, on their legs, wherever they have bad skin. It's just meant to promote health. So we're not going to add oil to your skin when your skin can produce those oils by itself and just stop doing it because it's old. So we, we try and reverse that, that uh, stressed state of those cells. We start allowing them to do it and act normally. Now, if we go into a young person, they might have one particular problem and we are tackling many, but we're not going to overdo it because the skin uh, is healthy. We're not going to make the skin even healthier than a 17 year old, uh, but, it's, uh, but the older person we are. So, the product is designed from the ground up to be a universal, everyone uses it. You don't change during your life, you don't put oils on your skin, you're really after something that's increasing the health of the cells in your skin.